Hey YouTube family, it's T-Bay82 coming in real quick just to share a hairstyle I'm attempting with you. Um, I actually posted pictures on Instagram yesterday showing that I was doing a roller set on my hair using sponge rollers. Um, yeah, I try, I'm trying to figure out a hairstyle for my friend's wedding and um, I did trial on her hair yesterday and I used the pipe cleaner curls and it didn't come out too great. The curls were too long, she needs something fuller and more bouncy. And since her hair was already done, I figured I'd try it on my hair and hopefully I can recreate this style on hers um, for her big day. So anyway, I have um, just regular sponge rollers and um, I'm not really a fan of the perm rods. They hurt my head when I sleep. So I wanted to try something that was a bit softer and more um, flexible to sleep on, even though they still hurt. Um, my hair was already retwisted. I retwisted my hair on Wednesday, I believe. So I just basically just wet it with some setting lotion and rolled two locks per sponge roller. And yeah, it took some time. It took me at least an hour. It was actually a lot of work. <laughs> so anyway, I just wanted to show you the before and I'll come back and show you the after. So yeah, I probably have about 52 rollers in my head. These are the three fourth of an inch rollers. So yeah, we're trying to get some bouncy curls. Hopefully this will work. So I'll be back in a few. Later. Hey YouTube family, I'm back. And these are the results of the um, sponge rollers after being taken down. Um, I'm ecstatic right now with these curls. Um, it's not really a style that I would wear personally, but for my friend's wedding, um, we're trying to figure out a way to create like really romantic, big, bouncy curls. Um, she, she, we're actually going to do like a faux mohawk type style, so we're going to have like some hair in the front and we're just going to pin the sides up, which will be very simple with this with these curls because they have so much height. So I think that this will work for her, so I'm really excited about it. Um, it did take a lot of time though, it's, a, it's something that I don't think I'll probably do. <laughs> um, again, it's going to be about an hour and a half to... Um, Put the curlers in my hair was already retwisted so these are the rolls i use the traditional throwback 90s foam rollers and um they come up really when you take them out this is how they look so you can see how tightly wound i wrapped them to get these really tight curls because you know my hair is pretty much showed a little bit um shoulder in the front and a little bit above bra strap in the back so to get it this tight i had to you know wind it really really tight um, but it took a long time, like it took an hour and a half to curl it and then at least, yeah, two hours under dry last night and I slept on it and still in the morning I sat under it again just for another half hour just to make sure it was thoroughly dry and that's a lot of time <laughs> but um, for a special day like a wedding I can see somebody doing it and this was a trial for my friend so yeah, I'm going to actually post um, pictures on Instagram, tday82 on Instagram, and I'll show you the results of this pulled out. Um, I'm also going to put pictures of the, this in, in this current state now, so you can check out the results there. And um, yeah, just use Lotta Body. My hair was already dry, sprayed it down really good with Lotta Body, rolled it up, went in the dry for hours, slept on it, and woke up, went in the dry a little bit more, and that's how I achieved these curls, and they're really bouncy, like these are not dropping okay so this will probably last for I would think at least like two weeks as long as you covered it with a bonnet and yeah it's pretty much it just thought I would share this with you guys I'll do a 360 and you can see pictures actual still shots on Instagram TV 82 so check it out Okay guys, until next time.